Hello. Oh, I forgot the light again. Let me light this up. <laughs> a beautiful evening. Welcome back. I hope you had a great break. I definitely had. Life makes me thirsty. Why is that? I mean, it's always good to know that you are a very creative person, Akasep, and I appreciate that. Even though most of the time I really can't follow your <laughs> titles until you came up with those. All right, um, we beat Chester. Yay! All right, um, yes. You're a little bit late on that, Timo, and a beautiful evening to you. So, um, we beat Chester. We are, I don't know how far the next bus is, like how much, I don't know, we have to grind or stuff like that, we'll see. So, but I do hope that we get a, like a, a peek at the next bus today. Would it be weird to ask you to grab those pictures on the wall and show them to the stream? Uh, it would be a little bit weird, I guess. I'm actually not gonna show you the picture over there. Um, that would be Timo's call, if I should or not. <laughs> but I can show you another picture which you actually not don't see on stream. Light is not broken. It's, 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 everything is fine. Are you not seeing? The light is turned on now. It, it's just, I, I just forgot to, I, I often forget to the second stream to turn it on. All right, uh, Buddha Ray Ray. Hey, nice here. Determ Determination has a new name and its name is getting past this level. Well, Buddha Ray Ray, we did it earlier. We, we did beat Chester, finally. <laughs> uh, but yeah, next boss is coming. All right, um, I can show you another picture which I made. Uh, but it's really old. I made it when I was like 13 or something. It's still not that terrible. It's uh, over here. It's like a little bit of a depress depressive art piece. I made it, I think I was 13 when I made it. Um, it's really simple, actually. I don't know how close I should, like, like this or like this. But yeah, it's a, it's a huge candle. I'm gonna put it back in place. My boyfriend actually doesn't like it because it's so, uh, its colors are so uh, dark and it's so depressing. <laughs> You did one of your exams in art history and you <laughs> so can judge it now my skills are finally useful. No, I wasn't three, I was like 13. Do you stream hashtag creative too? No, so far not, but I might. Not for painting though, uh, I probably would show you some digital art. Like these days, like I, I didn't paint in like a long time and everything I do artwise I do on the PC now. Damn, I have to turn off that autofocus. No, 13! Oh my fucking god, Treehugger, stop trolling me! 13! God damn it. The artist wants to show us that the candle is the light burning in her life and the darkness surrounding it speaks for a tough personal situation at the time. Oh my god, AK7 is obviously jumping in on it. Obviously. <laughs> oh. Uh, actually, I just noticed, uh, nah, no, I don't have it here. I still have a few drawings, uh, kept from, like, my teenage years, but, uh, I don't have them here. I think they're in the kitchen. I could show you some. Hey, Polymechanica, welcome back. I didn't say 30. 13. Finally, three years of studies for it paid off in this message. <laughs> oh, yeah, great, great, uh, great analysis there, Sleepy. Great analysis. No, it is actually a depressing image. Like, it is correct. I mean, but it's pretty obvious. Apes, congratulations. You did it. You're back. I didn't think you would make it. Make it. And the, your timing even is on point. We didn't even start. The facade is crumbling. But yeah, I might I might do some creative streams in the future. I actually did consider it because I have to draw more budgies. 
like I, I will show you very very quickly over here uh like that's the image um my starting image right i also use that image for the hosts and now that there is a budgie stream i want to draw all my budgies so i did consider whenever i do like the other budgies i also want to do a new banner and shit that i would stream that actually but yeah um I see the candle as a beacon of hope for future generation or as a use uh, protection campaign. Yeah, it's like a use protection campaign. <laughs> oh, that's actually hilarious. I mean, I was 13 and um, the image has kind of exactly that obvious level, right? God damn it, Abes. That's not what I said. How do you even how do you even interpret a K in there? But cheese. Like there's there's I can I can see how you interpret but cheese, right? But like but cheeks? No, there's no K in there. Oh but cheese are bay Wolfgang Amadeus da Vinci. Oh my god. But the like okay, 30 and then 13. Like there is a clear difference there. Well, whatever. Let's let's get started with the game. Um... <laughs> you should like if you if you you should you should get into the uh, is it uh, is it Liana or no what was it? Laurel is it Laurel or Yanni discussion. It's not meant to be better, but I can see how you can hear that instead of budgies. What is the is really the difference between 30 and 30 Leonardo to Nietzsche? <laughs> oh shit. Alright, let's see. I guess first of all we are supposed to go up there. I just wanna check around here. Like maybe maybe there's a treasure chest for the person that just beat Chester, huh? Maybe? The soundtrack is lit. Wait, next boss already? In that case, I probably should level first. Be, uh, still enough said we were underleveled. But please, I beg you to just spare my life. Pathetic worm. To think that slime like you orchestrated such inhuman atrocities against my people. <laughs> wow, tree hugger. But no matter, it's almost time for the final curtain. You're going to die like the disgusting pig you are. You just stay right where you are and watch the story unfold. It will all be over soon. Stop this, Chester! Please, you have to stop this. I know what I have to do, Elena. Our parents were murdered. Our home was burned to the ground. You may not remember any of it, but I'll never forget. I do remember. I remember our father's voice piercing through the flames, telling everyone to run while he stayed and fought. I, I remember the smile on our mother's face as she died knowing we were safe. Elena, you... I remember everything now. It's all just as you said it was. Those years before we came to Redmond. The events of that horrible day. Everything. I wish you wouldn't have. You'd been better off forgetting it all. No, we defeated him, but he didn't die. It's a JRPG classic, okay? We defeated him, but after the battle he just lives on. <laughs> but there's no need to worry. I don't intend to involve you in this. This is my struggle, not yours. I would never stay in another's hands with blood, least of all yours. Chester, I'm so sorry. You hurt so much all this time, but you kept it all bottled inside to spare my feelings. I never knew, I just never knew. But Chester, this, this is all for nothing. I don't think it's ever been possible to appease the souls of our people. What? They... they're not here anymore. 
after all the horrible things they've been through, I think what they really want, what they really want is just to rest in peace. I know our father would want us to be happy, together. He wouldn't want us to take revenge. Not like this. Not at all, even. I'll never be believe that ven vengeance would make him happy. No, oh, fuck that. If you're into butt cheese, I will totally judge you. <laughs> and that's all I want, Chester. I want him to be happy. And our mother? And you, and I too, I want us all to be happy. You may be stern, self-deprecating, and stubborn as anything, but you're the most dependable, kind, and thoughtful brother I could have ever asked for. You were there for me when our father couldn't be. I love you, Chester. So, please, don't do this. Don't force this on yourself. I... Yeah, it's too late. I knew he would give in, but it's too late. The the big evil creature is already awakening. What was that? No, what the hell have you done? I, I don't know. I, I never knew that much about the power of the statues to begin with. The construction of the clock tower, the massacre on Genus Island. I was just doing as I was told. Told? Told by whom? That would be me. Da, 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 da. I knew it! Oh my god! I mean, I didn't know this, but I, I said all the time that Nicholas looks super fucking evil and that he would betray us. I, I didn't know he was the mastermind behind all of this, but I knew he was evil. Bishop Nicholas? Count McGuire and Sir Stoddard, you've both done splendidly. Everything is proceeding according to plan. Oh, excellent. The child you heard is sickness that the power of the statues has been conferred to the one true god. What? Bishop, what are you talking about? I thought you were helping me exact my revenge. Well, of course. Since you were in collusion, I explained to you the secret of the clock tower, and you placed the statues in the appropriate spots, just as I instructed. Now their power has been drained and infused into the spirit vein that runs beneath this land. The four streams shall meet deep below the rocks of Genus Island, where they're to reunite as one and awaken Galvalan. The dark mist that's flooded the castle is merely a byproduct of his divine flow of energy. Still, I would say you achieved your or original intention quite admirably. Wouldn't you agree? Wait! Wasn't Galvalan destroyed a long time ago? <laughs> I find it highly amusing that a descendant of Genus should be so naive about the nature of Galvalan. Destroyed? Preposterous. An ancient being like that? He was simply drained of his power, cut to pieces, and forced into a wretched sleep. But that all ends now. This world will once again be under the watchful eye of a great and mighty god. Bishop, you're a man of the cloth. How can you say such blasphemous things? Ha ha ha! Oh, I cast off those outmoded beliefs long ago. I, Nicholas Garland, seek a true god with true power, not some mythical deity invented to scare children. I must say, Chester, my plan would never have succeeded so spectacularly were it not for your pity vengeance. I extend you to you my deepest gratitude. You! You bastard! Oh shit, that's that's some that's some big capital letters. <laughs> is he the is he the next boss? Like right now, I didn't even level up! Damn it, he's shielded. I guess I'm going to have to use this sword. Oh shit, that was easy. Huh, I know that blight. Prepare to die, you filthy heretic! Oh shit, I forgot about that dude. Chester. Let's just pretend Chester was weakened from the battle against us, okay? You don't have the power to probably wield that sword, you fool! Oh, are we gonna get the sword? Are we gonna get the sword? So, 
Now it's your turn to try and wane, is it? Very well, Edel Kristen. Perhaps you can offer me a worthy challenge. Let's find out, shall we? What? Give me the sword! Ouch! Oh my fucking god! What? What the fuck is that damage? Oh, okay, I'm not supposed to when I was on 1 HP. Yeah, it's staged, it's staged. That's it? And here I thought you were to be the next genus. Organus? You're coming with me, Chester. There's still one duty you must fulfill. Your people sealed God away, and the children must suffer for the sins of their fathers. Well, at least in... at least in... Uh, in... Uh, you don't you, you don't have healing items in this game, right? Oh hell, Keltas! I have I haven't paid attention to the game story uh, to the story at all. Galvalan is basically the the creature. I mean, we already knew that. That like we we found like a, a an ancient text uh, very early in the game that said that the power of Galvalan was sealed away in the four statues. So we know that very uh, like we knew very early that it's a super great plan to get with those statues and that Galvalon is probably going to be awakened and we're going to have to fight him. But obviously we couldn't control that. Galvalon is the final boss, but uh, as a fact I know we have still boss two boss fights to go. Wait, please. If you need a descendant of Genus, then take me, not my brother. <laughs> oh, how touching. Such love between brother and sister. Very well. Bring her. Dillarn. That was, by the way, the very first boss fight in this game against that witch witcher thing there. Edel, thank you for everything. When you came to rescue me, I was so happy. So moved. Please make sure Chester pulls through. No, waifu! You should have taken Chester, not our fucking waifu. Well then, gentlemen, I bid you adieu. I hope you're looking forward to God's revival as much as I am. When you said Organus, I thought of the organ and now I wonder if you already finished every Deponia game. Um... I, we actually didn't finish all the Deponia games. We stopped at the third part. Uh, but that was like, I was streaming Deponia in German when I was still streaming casually as a hobby. And then just when I started going full time, I just didn't pick it up again because I used to stream it in German. But we were close to the end of the third part. So, Bishop Nicholas was the puppet master behind this whole ordeal. I, I just can't believe it's true. He was always such a devoted proponent of God's teachings. But the facts are the facts, and this is no time to wallow in disillusionment. Not only has Elena been taken, but that earthquakes brought us new monsters, the likes of which we've never seen. Galvalin's resurrection is indeed nigh. The warning signs are all here. I mean, if I didn't take Eleanor, we could have just taken Eleanor and gone off to some other country and have a beautiful, uh, happily ever after. <laughs> Redmond cannot survive much more of this. Dear Lord, hear my prayer. Let's not bother the god just yet. Man's time is far from over. It's doggy, right? Oh no, it's the it's Doggy's teacher. Bearheart? What in the world are you doing here? It's been a long time, Mayor. I spoke with McGuire at the inn. He filled me in on the situation, more or less. Though thought I might lend my strength to the town's defenses. 
That would be most appreciated. With you here, we'll be able to stand our ground for as long as it takes. Is there anything you need for the job? Just for every able-bodied man to join the fray. And Father Pierre, I'd like for you to gather the women and children and make sure they're safe in the church. Understood. I'll get right on it. Now then, Edel, if you're to set off for Genus Island, there's the dark north of the town entrance along the road to the castle. Wait, are you... Wait, are you... You and Doggy came here on a small boat, correct? The inland's not far off shore. You can see it from the dark and should be able to reach it easily. Now wait just one second. Gather the women, children and sammies. <laughs> hey, Brand, welcome back. Eleanor may have been kidnapped, but you can't seriously be thinking of asking Adel to. Mayor, this young man has been guided down the path of Genus himself. Ultimately, it is his choice whether or not to go, but he knows as well as I do which option he will take. We mustn't hold him back. All we can do is give him our support. Great if, <laughs> great if other people make decisions for me. Time is precious. I'll start bolstering the town's defenses. Oh, and Adel. Chester's in the room next door. He awoke shortly after I arrived here. I believe he has something he'd like to say to you. He's gonna give us a new sword. I know it. Before you go, you may wish to pay him a visit. Ding. You... I, I must confess, I've made a terrible mistake. I involved innocent people in my quest for vengeance. I played right into the bishop's schemes. And as a result, I helped bring about the resurrection of Galvalon. I'm not worthy to carry this sword. Yes, you're not. Yes, give it to us! Please, take it. Da -da 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 -da. It's been handed down through generations upon generations of genus descendants. With it, you should be able to face the bishop on even footing. Ugh. Please, save my sister. Save Eleanor. Chester lapsed into a deep sleep. Ding! Ding, ding! A new sword! Oh shit! That's quite a buff. But we still want to have new um, ores to upgrade. No double jump in town! So yeah, Solonov actually told us that uh, outside of the town is a good area to level up. Uh, and we need two levels, so... God damn it, I hate flying. I hate flying shit. <laughs> oh, we took so much damage, alright. <sighs> Ouch! Why do you use so many saving slots? That was just a joke we made after beating uh, Chester. We're just grinding a level up right now. There cannot be too many uh, safe games, right? You know what else is a joke? Bring it. I can already tell that you wanna say something provocative again. Actually, 
actually no. We go back. My life? Why? Just randomly, or did something happen today? I ju got just locked outside of my house half naked? Nah, you're kidding. You're kidding. R really? Close to the next level up. Ouch. There we go. And somehow the garden store got locked. Oh shit. Hey Seth, nice to hear. We beat Chester, we beat Chester. And now we are uh, like we're, we're supposed to go to Genus Island. Right now um, I just uh, grind another level up because we know we should be level 44 to 45. And so enough earlier gave us the hint to grind outside of town. But yeah, next boss is second last boss. Uh, but actually, we can already uh, go to the castle. Oh wait, I can go there? No. Um, because we have to go to the boat anyways. I blacked out from being so tired, but I rested well with you screaming, oh my fucking god, oh nice, Seth. Watching you play makes me want to play the series. It's really good. I can, I really recommend it. The boat is over here. I'm not sure we want to go yet. What's that, by the way? Oh shit, what's about this enemy? Oh shit, he deals so much damage. Oh, okay, so we can beat that, uh, that as now. I still think, uh, st still think I should play Digimon. I still think this game right now is very superior to that, but not saying I would never, uh... Is that dude actually... No, he's not actually invincible. No, I didn't want to go back. God damn it. Okay, so but what I remember now... What I remember now is what we can do now before we go to Genus Island. Since we need to grind uh, to one more level anyways, right? There were some places... Uh, in the ruins... Wait, no, this is not where I want to go. Oh, this is the ru- Yeah, there was actually a place in the ruins, too. <laughs> oh, 
Ouch. Oh yeah, they don't hurt me. Bitch! Hmm. I just don't exactly remember where it was. Oh, I think we're correct here. Oh shit, so many of them! Are you kidding me? It's too many! I'm out of here! Oh. Uh. Give me some health! I mean, even if they do, probably give me, like, no health. Yeah, it's too many. Alright, fuck this shit. <sighs> Nothing is superior to Digimon. Digimon. I've seen a few people play it and uh, reviewed well. I haven't touched on the series of Digimon. I mean, I, I don't... I, I think Digimon is, is, uh, is definitely, probably, a decent game. That is what you get for it streaming Digimon. But that wasn't even a punishment. Hello? God damn it. Cool. We definitely need that other level up. <laughs> oh. Decent, how dare you. go wow that wasn't even that much experience i guess we just go to genus island and see if we can get another level up there yo you're late doggy unsubbed unfriended unfollowed <laughs> unfollowed. <laughs> i mean i give you that i can't judge it i never played digimon right Oh, don't give me that look. I'm not hurt that bad, and this is no time to be lying around in bed. Adel has been snatched away, right? I heard about it back in town. Adel filled doggy, uh, doggy in on all the details. Yep, that's pretty much what I figured. And I guess you were planning on going to the island all by your lonesome, right? Man, you need to learn to speak up sometimes. Just who do you think you're d dealing with here? First off, I mean, in the end, we're gonna fight alone again. <laughs> First off, the waters are choppy today. Unless you're used to it like I am, you'd never even make it to the island. So, I'm going with you, and that's that. Best make sure you've got everything you need before we set up, though. I get the feeling that's where what we're about to face won't go down easy with the usual weapons and armor. Wait. Is this a point of no return? Shit. I guess that's why Solonef told us to grind outside of city. I do wonder though if the other armor pieces might be behind those hidden spots. Fine. We gotta grind another level before we go. We might even try that uh, place in the ruins again. Like, what if there is actually the another armor piece? Though I don't think so. 
I think if a soul knife would have would have told us if that was the case, probably. Also, it would be too early to make it accessible, right? So probably it's just ores that would allow us to upgrade the uh, blades. Ouch. Oh my god. Fine. Bitches! Holy shit. God damn it, that was close again. Holy shit. Birds are overwhelming? They are! decent amount of experience it won't take that long again it's the tiny tiny um, orange bar above the uh, HB I know this gameplay is very exciting but that's what you have to do sometimes on nightmare don't think no we don't keep the charged magic Not as bad as the uh, little jumping thingy. God damn it. I lost the experience rate. Feels super bad. The experience bonus. Just want to keep the experience bonus. Right. 
All right, all right. It still takes quite a while this time. I'm so sorry, guys. But I promise you, we got to get some boss fight action today. Or, well, we always get some boss fight action, but, but you know what I mean. We're not gonna end stream without seeing the next boss. But I'm not sure we're gonna beat the boss today. It depends on how hard it is, really. Action. <laughs> And that after you just came back from your couch. We're now able to kill them faster because we got the uh, uh, strength buff. My body is still ready to sleep more. Oh no. Then you maybe should get a coffee. there but the third cup uh, cup of coffee what about it wait already burnt my tongue oh shit yeah you're right I remember sometimes forget uh, while grinding that I can also use my sword no I'm gonna lose my experience but I lost my experience bar, feels super bad. No, we're not gonna die right now. <laughs> Bad idea. I don't approve. There we go. Alright, we got it. Another level up. Here we go. Okay. Um, what we could do, we go to the quarry instead. Um... Because there was only one of those, uh, little, um, bad asses. Hello? All right, nice. That should allow us to upgrade our weapon once more. Ouch. Ah. Yay, let's level up some more. <laughs> no, no, it's fine. We're level 45 now. That's enough. But thank you so much for the bit, apes. 
we're just we're just collecting uh we're just collecting the the ores over here to upgrade our weapon that's all we're doing 390 that should be enough i think it's 300 oh no shit i don't know how much the new weapon costs to upgrade maybe it's not enough we will see Oh wait, oh wait, a quest. First off, I need more rebel ore than the miners spring back in a month, and that's a month the quarry's open, the quarry's open. Plus, like I said, when you pound rebel, you damage it. It's a self durable in nature, so there ain't no way around it. I learned the craft from my grandfather, though, and he learned it from the masters of Genus Island. And from all the stories he used to tell, I bet the miracle workers over there knew how to do it. Oh, so I can... Get some hint on Genus Island to get a new shield. I think that's what he's talking about. Let's see. It costs 700 to upgrade. All right, I guess. No upgrade for us. Yeah, I'm not so sure we will actually be able to. Um. Well, I'm still gonna try just to push my way through. Ouch. the menu button fast enough <laughs> out of here later bitches <laughs> oh all right what's that thread with the essence of the soul gradually heals wounds wounds but only when resting oh that sounds pretty good i probably missed more than just this but I don't remember other places that I left behind. I mean, if the sword, if upgrading that sword costs 700, it's pretty safe to assume that we will find more ores. So we could use the ores now to get that other uh, amulet. But where is that dude? Um. Or doesn't he need ores anymore now that uh, the world is about to be doomed? Am I too late to give him my ores? Maybe I'm too late to give him my ores. Man, you gave me. Gaming is back. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the bids. I wonder if you're actually incentivizing me to do more menu gaming, Milady Apes. All right, it's fine. It's fine. We're gonna go. So the thing is, because the smith told me that he needs some hints from Genus Island, I'm I'm pretty confident that we will still be able to go back. I wasn't sure after um, Doggy said we should prepare, but now I'm pretty certain that we will be able to come back. Maybe not before beating the next boss, maybe after that. The whole cheer is a conundrum. <laughs> All right, let's go save Eleanor. Oh, look at that, a CGI scene. High quality, guys. Look at those amazing graphics and those details. All the fishies in, inside the water. We can clearly see them. The beginning of the end. Nice. 
Like... So, this is where Chester and Elna were born, huh? It's quiet. Too quiet. And I don't like it one bit. Let's just get going before something horrible. Ah! Blah. Truly a 2008 cutscene, right? Oh, for crying out loud, Edel, I'm sorry. I won't be able to help you save Elna. Oh, really? I didn't see that one coming at all. <laughs> Don't worry about me. You go safer and I'll... I'll... Down I go. <laughs> Doggy fell unconscious from his boots. <laughs> oh, my God. What's that? Wow, Doggy's such a twist, yeah. I just want to know, but like, I probably uh, can just go back now. Oh wait, we can test this in a better way. Yeah. All this point of no return talk was just, was just bullshit. Or maybe? Nah, it's, it's, it doesn't matter. Let's go in and see. Oh shit, it is quiet. Oh. Oh! It's already boss time, I think. I knew you'd come. Oh shit! It's it's the it's the Witcher we fought for the very first time. No. The the Witcher was a was a dude. Oh it's this <laughs> Oh shit, it's the nun. At the castle, it was made perfectly clear that you have no hope of defeating us. And yet here you are. Be it gelant or foolish, you risk it all to save Elena. But I cannot let you pass. Oh shit! It was a girl all this time and Chad was like, no, this isn't a witch. I was like, at the start, I said it's a witch. And Chad was like, no, it's a dude. It's not a witch. It is a witch, Chad. I was right. The streamer is always right, okay? <laughs> it was a girl all along. My life or yours, the battle ends for one of us now. Round two, bitch! Oh shit, the swords, I remember those. Okay, this was the moment to get some damage in. Six thousand? Are you kidding me? Why couldn't I hit her? Okay, the window is very short to hit her. Oh, there are three! Okay, cool. And the fireballs is the is the uh, correct one. No. All right, all right, all right. Okay, okay, cool. So you were right, like always. It's an illusion. <laughs> Lag? What do you mean? Do you have some legs, like some stream legs? On my side, it's all good, uh, Brand.
You can't hit her because of lag? No, it was just, uh, it's intended. It was a doobel. Ah, oh, I got damaged too late. Really need to learn how to actually block this. Was too far away. to like recognize the correct one like before she throws the flames hey prince welcome back yes we beat chester this is the next boss this is like the uh this is like the second this was the second try I also feel like this boss isn't as hard as Chester. Uh, it's just like really mean how you like it. It becomes quite mean if it's like uh, many of them. Ouch. Bitch. Three times. Oh. Hey, Atherosaurus Rex. Welcome to the stream. This is Eth, Oath and Fulgana. I don't know if you're, uh, if you know the series. Eth is basically Eth is a, a 
action JRPG series, which already exists like the since the early 90s. Uh, Oath and Fulgana, though, is the sixth part, and it was released uh, 2003. Reminds you of Azure Dreams? Oh, true. It looks kind of similar. I never played Azure Dreams, but I've seen some of it. It, it has a similar style. This one looks like even more bullshit than the last. Uh, I, I don't think so, Prince, but I think it looks for you that way because you saw Chester at a point where I already fought him for a long time and was a lot better in dodging his moves. Like, right now I do still don't know how to move and to, how to dodge all the moves and that's the reason it looks it looks basically a lot worse, but it isn't. If you look, if you check out the first tries we had on Chester, then Chester will look way more bullshit because uh, I I didn't know how to move around him. Um, no, it's it's not. Uh, I'm just playing on my PC. It's on. Uh, I play the Steam version, but I use my PlayStation 4 controller. Um, but I'm playing on PC. I thought I might get hit by that. That one. God damn it. Only single player? Yes, this is only single player. I'm not seeing any difference on those Dolan characters. Yeah, me neither. Me neither, me neither. Does it have a leveling system? No, no, it's okay to ask that much question. It looks really nice since I played uh, through Dust and uh, Legion Tale. Uh, I'm looking for Hack and Slice. Uh, it does have a level system. I can't, like, I can't actually open uh, the menu during a boss fight. Um, you can see, um, okay, you can see above my, um, above my HP. The equipment we have like a sword we have some armor we have some shield and our armor and shield are are mixed out and then we have an accessory so like there is some basic equipment but you also have a level and our level is currently level 45 and um, to the left side you see that blinking star it basically means that our or flower whatever you want to call it it means our boost is ready that's like a, a, a short-term boost where you move faster, uh, have increased damage output and take less damage. And then you also have an uh, have three elemental attacks. Uh, right now we're using the earth elemental attack, that's the dash you see that can also block damage. No, they're not different classes, you're, st you, you're stuck with Edel. Uh, the, I'm starting to see the pattern in all these bosses. You dodge way too much junk, then get uh, one to three second attack opening. Uh, yes, for the later bosses, it's definitely that 
that way prints. It's always like you have to dodge a lot and then you get a short opening to deal damage. In the earlier bosses, it's not that heavy. Um, in the later bosses, it's definitely just that, Prince. The game um, has dungeons where you hack and slay your way through. Uh, but the boss fights are always very unique, just like this one where you have to like learn some pattern, um, perfect that, mix it with some reflexes, and yeah, that's it. Um, I'm playing on Nightmare, so the difficulty you see here is, is not the difficulty you have to expect when you play on normal. I don't know how to dodge those. Like the, the those strange moving swords. Those. Ouch. Too late. Like I have literally no idea how to dodge. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. No, 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 it's always the one that spawns the fireball to correct author. We already figured that out. It was more about if there's another way besides the fireballs to see which one it is. We already knew it, but it's, it's always the one with the fireballs, but like, I would like to know earlier, basically. Like... Oh wait, uh, the, it's the one who's not in the spawn pattern. Oh, wait, you mean like... It's difficult to say though, because that's like a triangle pattern, right? Like, if there are three, like there is none outside of the spawn pattern, right? I'm sorry, I just, uh, I, like, that's what I do. When I'm fighting a boss while reading messages, I just assume the rest of it. Alright, I see Dark Souls 4.0. Yeah, kinda, kinda. Oh, yeah, I do get what you mean. There is one sometimes outside of the pattern. You're right, not always, but sometimes the real one is kinda out of pattern. Like, here not. There they really spawn at exactly the same moment. No, it's okay, it's okay. No worries, no worries about your English. Your English is fine. Uh, well, it still seems, though, like that it's rather rare to see. one yeah ouch in the middle actually when they spawn gives me the best chance of dodging uh oh 
Yeah, I have to be in the middle. God damn it. Actually, it looks like the fireball guy is moving counterclockwise. It's always a step or two forward. Really? God, I went to the middle, but I was like a little bit too close. Uh. Timing on the jump has to be so perfect when I'm in the middle. Ah, fuck, it's that one! No, there is... Okay, there is no different gear in this game, uh, Athero. There's, uh, like, you don't have, like, uh... The only thing to make you stronger is upgrading your weapons. Uh, we can't upgrade our sword, though. We are missing, uh ores for that and you only get ores from chests like there's no way to farm that the only thing you can farm in this game is your level um believe me it's fine we're not under equipped or under leveled we're just playing on nightmare um you could uh, if you want to you can check out uh, today's watch from earlier from our first stream and watch the previous boss battle we had that was like a quite a bit more challenging Sorry, I have to go again. I swear if I don't take a nap after doing work for this guy, I'm gonna lose it. <laughs> Alright, Prince, no worries. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good nap. Um, and there is no such thing as... Like, the armor is just higher defense values. There is no such thing as... Uh, it's pretty simple when it comes to armor in this game. Like, there, there is no... Yeah, I should have... Uh, it happens when I talk. It's fine. There's no su such thing as, like, armor you can choose from in this game. There's just, like, basically uh, five armor sets you get over time. Besides the sword, uh, we have everything from the fourth set. But we don't have access to the uh, other armor yet. To the better armor. The only choice you have in this game is accessories. Um... But in this battle, there's no special accessory that would help us. We have, like, for example, shoes against uh, ground that is slippy. But uh, there is no slippy ground in this battle. Or we have shoes that protect from lava damage, but there is no lava in this battle. The only thing is I have to use, start using my boost more. Um, the dash I use is, by the way, this earth elemental tag. 
which allows you to um, block some damage, but it co consumes mana, so you can't block an infinite amount of damage. Oh, I hit her. That was funny. Uh, there is a way to dodge it. Just move the right way. <gasps> like there, for example, it just has to, it's just perfect timing, that's all. Oh, fuck. And for that, you have to use your earth dash. It's just jump and dash, yes. It's just jump and uh, jump and dash. Ah, oh, god damn it! Shouldn't have made a turn. Funny that I randomly dashed into her. No, <gasps> miss a stationary target. Ah, oh, fuck. And thank you so much for the follow. Nice you here once again. How long are you going to stream? Uh, probably until we beat this boss. Uh, I stream usually two times per day, but the second stream is a little bit shorter. Um, uh, but tomorrow, Saturday, is my off day, so no stream tomorrow. After today, I'm gonna be back on Sunday. I'm streaming four days per week. I don't stream uh, Saturday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Tuesday and Wednesday, I have to work. Oh my god. The thing is, I think the, like, these swords that, like, go kind of, like, on the ground, the way to dodge them is just to double jump with perfect timing. While the, like, there are the swords that go straight, you just have to run fast in a, in a wide circle. While those flying around uh, swords you can dodge with just jumping perfect, double jumping ter perfect timing. All right. Good night, Arthura. Thank you so much for tuning in. Have a beautiful rest and hopefully maybe see you on Sunday. This is, by the way, uh, the second last boss in this game. Um, so hopefully we will on Sunday close in on the last boss. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking, forgetting that I have to deal some damage. What? You can't multitask? Yeah. Ah. Did 
Too late. Take that, bitch! It looked like I wouldn't get hit there. Retro Shred Metal Band. Hey, welcome to the stream. Why is the music so good? I know, the boss battle music in this game is definitely lit. It's definitely lit. Oh, God damn it!
shit, I'm too What is the fuck is that, by the way? Hello? 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 <gasps> I thought this is a medieval game! What are those laser snipers, please? <laughs> oh shit. We debated doing an E3 song on the next album. I don't know what music E3 is, but I can recommend Persona. Persona 5's soundtrack was still the best. Oh, a lot, a lot of it remakes in this game. Adol is a true warrior. Seems normal. I want to watch this actually for a little bit. So there are those little things. They are randomly, very randomly flying around. And they do those lasers. And then they disappear. Huh. Alright. Ah, uh, god damn it. Ah. Uh. Yes, welcome back, new boss hive, that's right. Remember the boost? Yeah, I know, I know, I know. So close, ah, uh, kinder, kinder. I think we were close the last time, right? I think we were at 1,100. Hitting stationary targets, Sammy. Difficult. Very difficult. Mm. 
This is the first boss, right? Yeah, yeah, this is the second last boss uh, of this game. We, you, you didn't miss a boss. Oh, you mean it's the very, f yeah, yeah, it's also the very first uh, boss you fight uh, in this game. Uh, version 2.0, basically. even know what to look at. So love, thank you so much for the host. I hope you had fun. Ah, uh, and welcome back to the next boss. I don't even know what to look at when these laser pointers are uh, coming at me. Snipers are OP? Yes, they are. here yet even though he hosted or was it an automatic host no it wasn't I'm just about to go to sleep. All right. Have a beautiful night. Thank you so much for the host. Ah! Maybe you want to uh, 
Uh, you wanna give us a hint about the laser pointers or maybe not, I don't know. I do wonder, for example, if you can actually uh, kill those little thingies off before they even do the laser pointer action. Good luck with the bosses. Thank you so much, Solnav, though I don't think we're gonna see another boss besides this one today. Jump and use shield. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, I did figure that out, though currently I'm running out of mana doing that. That's all what I can tell you. Yeah, thank you. Ah! Bitch. Hey, Millie Mac, nice to hear. Welcome to the stream. That's so cheap. Solnef's hint or this boss? Uh. Again, I'm not using my boost. Trigger. Again, I'm not using my boost. This boss and these arrows. Yeah, it's kind of rough. You need to have like perfect timing. But that's what all these bosses are about. Shit. So the thing is. I need perfect timing on the arrows, like I don't have to do, do, use uh, take damage in the first phase. And the second thing is, whenever before the bitches spawn I have to be in the middle, then it's the easiest. Then I just jump towards the correct one and don't get hit by anything. So Millie Mac, lasers are annoying, that's for sure. Um, did, you, uh, did you play this game or did you see it for the first time? Easy only requires perfect timing, right, right. What? God damn it. Never seen it before. I was actually gonna ask if this was a new uh, maple story. <laughs> oh shit! Where's 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 the bitch? Didn't see where the fireballs were. Oh fuck!
close. <gasps> Even the sounds, it's mind melting. God damn it. I was part of Solo's raid earlier and I know him through Bruce Princess. Oh. I see. Solonev abducted you over here. That's very nice of Solonev. Quick trivia on normal, they show you uh, wh who's the real one. Oh! Though, that isn't a problem for us anymore, to be honest. Like, the plan is just to be in the middle and then jump, and then I see where the fireballs come from and jump into that direction. I don't see think that's the biggest problem. I do wonder if the if the lasers are part of part of normal too. Oh. I thought that would be the run. I thought so too. That's okay. We're gonna fuck up three more times and then we're gonna do it. Ah! God damn it. After a good run, always comes a bad run for me. Yeah, it seems like you need quite a lot of HP for the laser attacks, yeah. It, this run is pretty over. Yeah, I'm you're not allowed to jump against the straight uh, daggers. by the way is really evil straight daggers into the broad daggers because against the broad daggers you have to jump while against the straight daggers you're not allowed to jump ouch I don't remember who it was to point out that your shoe slumped like a horse galloping. I think it was Solonev. No, it was actually... Solonev was talking about the mates. No, it was Monster. It was Monster. I'm wrong. It was Monster.
Fuck you! Uh... I don't even know! I, like, I have no idea how to dodge swords and lasers at the same time. I don't know. I just don't know. I guess we just need to perfect the first phase and then we have enough HP to finish to finish uh, her before the lasers kill me. You now can't hear anything else but a horse. I think it was monster actually. Feels bad. For some reason, I knew it was the left one, but I don't know if it's coincidence or if I actually, my brain actually subconsciously um, figured out the pattern. Sounds familiar that it was monster? Yeah, I also think it was monster. The dream! God damn it. <laughs> Gotta go to bed. I can't keep my eyes open. Excellent stream. Oh no, apes! Did you miss it? Did apes actually go to bed seconds before I finished this boss? Uh, good luck beating this boss. It's not far. You're doing great. Thank you so much, apes. I was doing great. Glad I stayed. Congrats. Thank you so much, apes, for the bits. <laughs> and have a beautiful rest, Apes. Thank you so much. Easy? Yeah, this one was, was a lot easier than Chester. Though, to be fair, Chester prepared us, right? Uh, fighting Chester for, for, for more than two days was basically... What prepared us for everything. <laughs> Thank you so much, Apes. Have a beautiful night. Thank you for the bits. 
We're so good, chat. Holy shit. Adel, you've gotten really strong. Once he saved my life, he saved my soul. His words, the sight of him, was all I ever had to live for. But then he went to the Ilburn's ruins and he came back, changed. Even so, I still had faith in him. And then he and I became of one body. Twelve years ago, we attacked the people of this island. Maybe this is punishment for my sins, for my blind devotion. Thank you, Adel, for saving my soul. That's such a classic, too. After you beat the shit out of them, they all of a sudden realize how, th how wrong they were. <laughs> because that's how it works, right? You get the shit beaten out of you and all of a sudden you realize all of your mistakes. Violence is the solution. Not. Please help her. S save Eleanor. Da 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 let's go back and save the game dee 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 What time is it? Yeah, actually, I'm sorry guys, but like I have to go to a table soccer tournament uh, tomorrow. Usually I still go for an hour or so, but since I have to go get up early and uh, play a table soccer tournament, I'm gonna end the stream here for today. If you're new to the stream and enjoyed it, please consider to draw the follow. I'll be back on Sunday. Saturday is my free day. Um, I'm t I stream twice per day, so on Sunday I will be here around noonish ti American time and um, late afternoon late afternoonish uh, European time. I thank you for watching and Kingsnaker. Did you, Kingsnaker, were you here when we beat Chester? No, yeah, you were here, yeah, I remember you were here when we beat Chester. So Kingsnaker, you watched us beat two bosses today, two bosses per day is back. And yeah, only one boss remaining, though as far as I know, we still have to go through a dungeon before we uh, see the last boss, so Sunday we probably, uh, first, ha first stream is gonna be uh, going through the dungeon and then second stream is gonna beat the shit out of the last boss hopefully probably not we we'll probably not beat the final boss uh in one go we'll see thank you so much for watching have a beautiful weekend and hope to see you on sunday bye bye god damn it my okay now <laughs>